Welcome to Sunday. Welcome to French Toast. I ran up to the store and got the necessities. And Matt was starting us off with some delicious, well, what would be breakfast, but it's actually like almost 12.30. Um, I don't, I think we still don't really have a plan for today. Uh, when we first, when we first got up, um, I mean, we had just gotten out of the shower and I, I would, I had just gotten out of the bed and was sitting in this chair. When he walked out of the shower, I was like, so what are your turnip prices? <laughs> Cause it's Sunday, we have to buy turnips. Um, mine were 110, Mal's were 105, meals were 101, but luckily, uh, our friend Thomas, uh, had them for 92, so we invaded his town. And Tom, Thomas is our turnip dealer. Yeah, he told me, he sent me a message that says, I am the drug dealer. And when I left his town, I said, thank you, pusher man. Anyway, uh, so we got our turnips, so we're all set for the day. I'm not really sure what we're gonna do. Um, there's, it's actually a pretty nice day. Um, I'm sure we'll leave the house and do something. But for now, we're gonna have French toast and probably play some video games. That's good stuff. It's also really tall. I normally spread mine out, but I saw a meal keep them tall, and I was like, I'm gonna keep them tall. And they're, it's kind of more visually interesting, and it also makes me feel like I'm eating a lot more food. The design student is concerned with how his French toast looks on the plate. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes, I am. Started our trek outside into the fresh air uh, by going to Kilgore Trouts and picked up two games. They had Sonic Adventure 2 uh, for, uh, it's actually 18, I thought it was 13, but uh, $18, it's worth 32, it's not bad. And uh, Fighting Masters for the Genesis, I paid eight, it's worth 16, so not bad. I was the only one that got anything, but that's okay. Now we're gonna go back to Broadway, which we were at the other night, but it was really crowded. Dolphin? Dolphin? Oh, that's true. We should probably go to the Gay Dolphin because we're right next to it. We're going to go to the Gay Dolphin, which is the, pretty much, I don't know if it's the biggest tourist shop in Merlo Beach, but it's like the most well-known. It's been around forever. But the meal's mostly just hot. <laughs> God, that sounds annoying. It just sounds like someone perpetually peeing in the corner. I think there's a world record for that. Peeing in the corner? I mean, like the longest time someone has continuously peed. Oh yeah, definitely. Actually, I looked up stuff like that one day in college, <laughs> so I've looked it up. We'll we just have, have the to... master right here. Yeah, I know something about peeing for extended lengths of time. We decided it was a little too hot to do some of our outdoor activities, so we're going to Wonderworks. Um, I went to one in like Gatlinburg when I was like 12, and uh, it's a good indoor activity that we haven't done. Yet, Mal's never been, Emil's never been, and I haven't been in over 10 years, so. You know, it's next up to the Arizona Science Center. Well, this, I think this is more of like a themed thing, maybe for, maybe for kids, I don't you know. You were telling me it was like a, a science-y thing. So. It is, it is. Uh, it's been a long time, but I, I think we'll enjoy it. Oh, you want to try it? 
Is it cold? Yeah. Feels like a glass of ice water. Yeah, but it cools the body really fast. It yeah. drains you of your heat. Like it's draining the energy of my hands so quickly. And then moving it just tires it out quicker. But you don't have a choice because you're swimming. Six feet eleven. Matt, why don't you try it? Because last time you had zero. You had zero that, like last night. Butter, whipping clown, monkey, semi pro crusher, iron robo gorilla champion. Ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna predict she's a she's a for the gorilla. Semi pro. All right. Your score is 77. You're still testing. I can't do any more. Oh well, that was 77. So that's pretty good. I'll try. Oh, jumping up to 140, 141. Looks like we're stuck at 141. <laughs> yeah, I think that's going to be it. Semi 41. Very, very nice. I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to get that much. With all you got. Mal's gonna try this crazy thing. Good luck. Wow. I'm impressed. Oh, you're playing on easy mode. <laughs> you gotta go to the hard level. <laughs> Do you have control of it? I have no idea. I thought it was just automated. It sounds like the more you pedal, the, the faster you get to go. Oh my god. Yeah, she went up a lot quicker than the last guy. Yeah, for the record, me and Emil weren't really interested in this one, <laughs> but Mal wanted to ride it. Whoa! They're getting there. They haven't gotten it to go all the way around yet. Yeah, that's what it's doing without anyone in it. So maybe your pedaling really does do it. Oh! Oh my god. Pedal harder. Pedal harder, bogeys. Medium level. Medium. Let's see what you can do with medium. Is it noticeably harder? A little. <laughs> it actually doesn't go much higher than that. Huh? It doesn't go much higher than that. It's about to hit the limit. Yeah, there it is. You want to try the hard one? I guess so. That is so hard. Really? And my feet kept slipping off the yeah. pedals and I couldn't you're, pedal. Oh. Don't stop that you're pedaling. We're like, no, don't stop pedaling. My feet fell off. Oh, okay. Mills already went through easy and medium. He's going to try hard. <laughs> You're doing it. It just seems like it's a lot harder. Your face is all scrunched up. <laughs> Here. Yeah, the thing is at the top. My hands are really strong, but I think you probably have more upper arm strength than I do. I don't know if I'd be able to even do this. Do you even lift? <laughs> oh, this one you, or pushing? You're pushing. See the arrows? Your grip score is 63. Go, go. Uh, much higher than mouse. Slicker. Uh, I can't go anymore. Definitively average. <laughs> City slicker. Uh, Ain't milking our cow, partner. Mills uh, beating uh, you. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, oh. Oh God, that's your score. <laughs> no, I got 149. Really? Yeah. With one hand squeezing, it was... So now we need some third type of gripping the Malkin way. Uh, now we have to find a gripping that you're gonna... I am very disgruntled about my hand. Ba 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 ba! <laughs> Put like your whole hand in. Yeah. You didn't used to have one of these as a kid? I know, but not this much. Oh. Hey Mal, we can reenact the scene from Big. We could. <laughs> Pull a SpongeBob. First you do this, then you do this and that, this and that. And <laughs> then. Oh, I missed. <laughs> That's my man, and also my cat. <laughs> Nothing's doing anything. Oh, wait, that did. You're doing it. You're flying the plane. 
You're not really keeping it steady on the runway. <laughs> It seems that you've hit the Jack Daniels before getting on the tarmac today. Um, <laughs> man, if I saw... You, yeah, you need, there you go, pull up. Get in the air. There you go. Oh, dear God. You're doing, I know how to speed up. You're doing well. Look at that view over there of those nice little neighborhoods. Yeah, that's where you're heading. <laughs> 9.3 kilometers that way. You got this. You haven't crashed your plane yet. Oh, that's another plane. That's not where I'm supposed to go. Oh. Crash into it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do a barrel roll. Why did it like rumble the whole seat? Yeah, I think, oh, uh, I don't think they want to show you crashing into a forest. That's a really cool picture. Herp derp skirp der herp der herp herp skirp herp skirp herp der herp der herp herp skirp herp skirp da na 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 Oh, you want it? You want it? Oh my god! Oh, look at that one! He's like flopping around. That fish is surfing. It'd be interesting to bring like a bucket of fish food and just stuff it in one spot. Should we do that before we go? We came to Mellow Mushroom for dinner. Uh, Emil has been here before, but we're trying some different pizzas. We're also trying um, cinnamon sugar pretzels. He hasn't had them before, but he says that they're pretty freaking good. They're pretty freaking good. Approval! Me and Emil are sharing a house pizza, Malgot and Cosmic Karma. Since this is the first time you've had house, what do you think? Pretty good? It's it's my favorite kind. I haven't had all of them here yet, but they're it's pretty good. We're in an arcade partly because it is nice and cool, and we're gonna have a ski ball tournament. We just had one with Dan. We're gonna see how Emil stacks up, and also if we can increase our scores. So, do oh, I missed? I thought she missed. Okay. A thousand. Okay, two thousand. Okay. It looks like this one's not broken. Good job. Excellent job. Oh, oh, oh wow! Oh crap! Okay, yeah, what? that's not See, good. See, she does terribly in the first half, and then after like a few rounds, she does amazing. Oh, she's go still got a few balls. <laughs> oh, oh, really wants that ten thousand? I see. I rarely ever go for the ten thousand. To be honest with you, like it just—it's hard to get. It's so much risk with like very little reward. Oh, we just rolled off the end there. All right, 16,000. Emil, want to try? Yes. All right, a solid 2K. And 2K. You could just get straight 2K and win. Oh, no. Uh, I ruined everything. <laughs> oh. oh, it really rolled around there. I think it's still beat by 1,000. Never mind. Uh oh. The so straight 20s appear out with No. Oh crap. Oh, what? Wow. That was unlucky. And the it's last. It's like a 50 to tie her. No, I got a 13. Pretty close, though. All right, my turn. Oh. Oh yeah, look at all our coupons. What are we gonna do? We could get a Tootsie Roll. Blinko, Powers. Black White. Got four tickets. Four. 
All right, tickets. And we can still not afford anything. Really? We can buy two rubber bands and an ice cube. <laughs> we came back this evening and uh, been playing some video games. There's still a bunch of games uh, part of Nintendo Land I haven't gotten a chance to play. Like, I just played the Captain Falcon game for the first like time. Steven's picture right there. <laughs> Is that like based on something I did? Yep. Uh, yeah, on the gamepad, you fly up towards the screen and hit your face on the screen. Oh. Because it's an overhead view and you get blasted up. Oh, okay. Well, that makes sense. So it's like, what? And you hold it this way, which is different, but it's cool because you can use it both ways. It's almost like Brain Age, because Brain Age made you hold the DS yeah. vertically. And uh, Emil's getting a chance to see our wedding album, which is interesting. He's getting a chance to enjoy our very casual wedding. <laughs> Flip-flops. Flip-flops are a good idea for a wedding. <laughs> After a particularly long Animal Crossing session, we're going to bed. Tomorrow is Emil's last day. It's not even a full day, but uh, we still have a few things planned that we're going to do. <laughs> Something that Emil came up with that should be freaking amazing. So there's that to look forward to. And now in typical fashion, thank you so much for watching. And... <laughs> I spy with my little eye the three sacred treasures. And it will never, never end correctly. It'll never end correctly. It'll never end correctly. Are Steven you... and I both got a hole in one going through the tunnel. That was awesome. We didn't even go down the middle. Okay. Yeah. And then Can you grab them all? I got them all. Awesome. <laughs> cool. Damn Stormcloak rebels. Oh, I'm an Imperial then. I have important documents for you, sir. Is that so? Lost your uniform along the way, did you, soldier? Uh, ditched it for this. It's uh, easier to All sneak. Right. What? 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 What?